कल्चर इज टाइम बाउंड एंड मस्ट चेंज विथ टाइम एंड इट इज ऑलरेडी चेंजिंग विथ टाइम हंड्रेड ईयर्स बैक यूड हैव सेड कास्ट सिस्टम अनटचेबिलिटी नॉट इवन अनटचेबिलिटी अनसीएबिलिटी देर आर सर्टन पीपल यू आर सेंग दे कैन नॉट इवन बी सीन these are great parts of our culture didn't you change that weren't there social reformers today we worship those social reformers in their time those social reformers you threw mud at them and you abused them and you even wanted to kill them and you said these people are destroying our culture because they are talking of abolishing child marriage and they are talking of widow remarriage and no 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 Widow remarriage cannot be done in our culture. No widow remarriage, and in our culture, kids should be married at the age of five. And in our culture, the woman should be burnt on the pyre of the husband. These things were part of your culture. No, we are proud that we reformed and refined our culture. Aren't you proud of that? We are proud that we have a better culture today. Similarly, culture should always keep getting refined. with a view towards the truth do not take culture as sacred or holy satya is holy not sanskriti are you getting it satya is sanatan sanskriti is not sanatan sanatan means timeless sanskriti is time bound getting it so i am not discounting the importance of culture what i am saying is remember the place of culture vis a vis the truth culture should be a shadow of the truth culture should be a follower of the truth hmm? do not think do not place culture in a position where it becomes the absolute only the truth is absolute culture is not absolute the upanishads do not sing of sanskriti they sing of satya the saint poets didn't sing of sanskriti they talked of satya unfortunately in today's india there is a very unfortunate uh, kind of uh, cultural aggression taking shape everybody is talking of culture and nobody is talking of the real thing satya truth they have started equating culture with religion but religion is not culture religion is something in service of the truth are you are you getting it huh have great traditions and always be careful that your traditions are pointing towards the truth only then the traditions have life otherwise the traditions fall dead and there is no point carrying dead load over the centuries i'm not discounting traditions there can be beautiful traditions but only when you know the meaning of those traditions only when those traditions arise from your heart just ritualistically and blindly obeying traditions will take you nowhere hmm? if traditions have to exist let there be lively traditions in fact with an eye on the truth with a mind devoted to the truth you can even begin new traditions because all traditions began at some point in time so why can't new traditions begin today new great sacred traditions can begin today and even the traditions that begin today must end at some other point in time because today's traditions will be applicable to today's man today's environment today's society today's economy 200 years later those traditions might uh, not be useful so then those traditions can be reformed or totally disposed away and the new traditions should come up traditions are not sacred traditions can be dropped and new traditions can be started and even ancient traditions can be continued if there is meaning in them hmm? and that meaning you don't need to superimpose on the tradition because that's also a trend these days take some random tradition and superimpose meaning on it say no 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 this tradition is not random it has this meaning no no the tradition has no meaning at all you are needlessly imposing meaning on the tradition no that kind of pseudo scientific thing don't attempt please let the tradition have real meaning and then it can continue for long otherwise drop it